Hi, I'm Danny. I'm going to show you how I trim the borders of this 0.45mm aluminium sheet using my famous knife. Actually, after <coughs> doing several sheets uh, of this thickness, I found that uh, after cutting 20 times a side, it almost drops off, almost. Now, 20 times to cut with one blade, it's too much. So, I got two knives and I'm going to do 10 times with each and then uh, I'm going to break off the end so that I get the sharp one again for the next stage. So, what do we do? We do like this. Take the straight, straight edge, place it carefully, not there, and then we go. One, two, three, four, Seven, eight, nine, ten, and I can feel it becoming blunt. So I switch to the other one and do another ten. Oops! Didn't need even another ten, as you can see and it cuts through. Okay, now we clean it up a little like that. But I'm gonna take a sharp edge anyway, so we break all the ends. and go for the next part. That's the problem because and the problem is that that is so narrow, so this doesn't hold it very well, well. But let's first to first first of all, let's do it here. Like this. Alright. 
then let's see if the other ruler maybe holds it better. By the way, I buy the knife, knives in packages of 50, it's a lot cheaper than just getting the smaller ones. most afraid of while cutting is to touch the picture because this one has been drying for two or three days it's not completely dry if I put my finger on it I leave a fingerprint and you don't get those away I'm thinking even Maybe I should give them a thin coat of spray varnish before I start handling them, even though I'm going to raisin coat them later. But just to protect the surface when I'm working on them. Patience here to get everything off. That's it. Right. So we got our trim picture.
and now it's ready now it's ready for rising coating which is the next step thank you just a short postscript to the video you saw I had some problems uh, there with uh, this ruler it's a nice big one it's new I just got it yesterday so it was the first time I cut with it now instead of redoing the video and you don't see me having any problems I decided to leave that so that uh, you can maybe profit from my mistakes also so with this new ruler what happened was that the edge which I was going to cut here it was only about three maybe four millimeters and here the edge is very slippery this one is not but edge here is very slippery so it didn't hold it well enough somehow this other ruler did it better and uh, well something you have to check before you start making a nice video okay thank you again okay.